I posed the question, who are the worst quarterbacks in the league this year? It's a question that I think is sort of tough to answer because there were a lot of guys who got benched. There was a lot of guys who got hurt, um, people who didn't have uh, complete seasons. So I want to sort of cut through some of those. I mean, the uh, the Trubisky's and the Kenny Pickett's of the world, like they were bad, obviously, but were they the worst in the league? Who do you have as the worst quarterback in the league this year? Zach Wilson. To, to me, it's, it's not just the numbers. It's literally just like that guy looks like he can't play NFL football. Like that's that's number one to me. How about you? I think mine's Russell Wilson. And I know that uh, Zach Wilson had worse numbers. Zach Wilson is a second-year player. He obviously sucks. Uh, Russell Wilson, they moved heaven and earth to bring him in there. You know, with expectations as high as they were. I don't think Zach Wilson's expectations were as high. And that's not the question. I know that. But I think that uh, watching Russell Wilson and watching him play, there were a couple of games where he would take a snap and he wouldn't even drop back. He just turned side. He'd get the snap and he just turned sideways. And the pockets collapsing around him, and it's like he didn't even know it. Like it was, it was like watching a guy uh, who had his memory erased try and relearn how to play quarterback. That's what it looked like watching him play this year. That's what I've heard a couple of times that he was so off that he, he just so like flummoxed by trying to learn this new offense that he was starting to revert to hand signals and things that he used <laughs> with the Seattle Seahawks, and the receivers are just like, we don't know what those are. <laughs> Like we, we weren't in Seattle with you, Russ. Like, I mean, his brain just looks like it was absolutely broken by this Nathaniel Hackett experience. So I would say if you're talking about the most disappointing quarterback, hmm. then he's probably up there. Yeah, because he's he's a guy who seems to be playing himself out of like a couple of years ago. You could have seen a, a case for Russell Wilson to be a Hall of Famer. Sure. Right. Could you see that now? No. I mean, and it's not it's not just this year. The last couple of years that he's been declining, and this is just the latest. There will be a debate for him when it's time. Yeah, but I don't. I think it's not. It's not a sure thing anymore. Yeah. That's for sure. I mean, he was playing at an MVP level for a couple of years there, yeah. and now when you talk about let Russ cook, he's out there cooking things completely <laughs> raw and serving them to you, and it's like, nope, I'm not about that. Um, Can so, I enter an exhibit here, please? Absolutely. Uh, Go ahead. When you asked the question, when you made the tease before the commercials. You asked who's the worst quarterback in the league right now, mm-hmm. and uh, Kyrie just left on a very, very evil laugh. <laughs> 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 he knew his answer right away. <laughs> that's true. And uh, listen, it wasn't. We gotta not... keep that forever. You understand that? Right? Yeah, that's good. That's good <laughs> stuff. That's like Doctor Evil. Um, Zach Way better Wilson, than Doctor Evil. Uh, Russell Wilson. There's some other names out there that we could uh, that we could toss out. So, so I let's think. say let's say if we got a top five list of bad quarterbacks, we've got two. The Mount Rushmore of ass quarterbacks. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. So so, we so if we're talking about Mount Rushmore, that's, Zach Wilson we've is uh, we've, George Washington. <laughs> 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 and, uh, Russell Wilson is um, I is don't John know. Adams. John, well, is, who's, is he on there? No, I don't even know who's on Mount Rushmore. You know what? I've been there too. Uh, who's on Mount Rushmore? Abraham Lincoln. George yep. Washington, uh, Teddy Roosevelt, and FDR. And FDR. Yeah, FDR okay. okay. So let's make... Uh, wait, wait. Is FDR on it? Uh, yeah, Roosevelt and Lincoln. No, it goes no, Washington, no, Jeff- Jefferson, Jefferson, Roosevelt, Lincoln. Roosevelt, Lincoln. Washington, Jefferson, Jefferson, Roosevelt, Ted- Lincoln. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. FDR yeah, is not on it. There, there we go. Yeah, All right, so, so Zach got, is uh, George got, Washington, Thomas Jefferson is Russell Wilson. Yeah, so de- um, definitely definitely got to go back to school on that one. Okay, so we got, we got, two, we got two out of four. Uh, yeah, we got two out of four. All right, who's our Roosevelt? Who, or, give me yours. Um, give me yours. I think it might be Mac Jones, unfortunately. Ooh. I think it might be Mac. Uh, I would not put him as worse than Zach Wilson or Russell Wilson. No, 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 no. But I'd say he's in the conversation of the top five worst quarterbacks in the league this year statistically. I mean, I don't know how you could how you could deny it. I'm not saying it's even 100% his fault, but we're talking about who is the best, who is the worst. He's in the, he's in the bottom. He's at the bottom of the list. I'm sorry. So, so I'd put Mac there at third. I mean, so, the fourth has to be whatever asshats playing for Houston. At, at this <laughs> Davis moment. Mills. So, so that's, yeah. that's, that's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. If we're talking about Mount Rushmore, Mac's not on mine. But he's but he's the runner up. Okay. So Zach Wilson, we got we got Zach and Russell Wilson, Davis Mills, who's I mean, yeah, he's he's atrociously horrible down there in Houston. And I'd say Carson Wentz. Carson Good Wentz one. Carson Wentz is pathetically bad. And hey, he's gonna get a chance to play because Taylor Heineke is well, I mean, everybody was enamored with Taylor Heineke for a little bit there, and then everybody remembered that he's Taylor Heineke and he's not that good. So now Carson Wentz gets to come back with the season on the line and see if the commanders can make the playoffs, and they're gonna find out that Carson Wentz is, you know, once again, bad. And Hot probably, garbage. And they're probably not gonna make the playoffs. But if look, if you're talking about like if you're one of those people who likes EPA per play like I do, you know, and you and you go on uh, RBSDM stats, you know, kind of the Ben Baldwin site, Mac Jones is 
the fifth worst quarterback in the league by you know uh, you know estimated points added per play and completion you know, percentage over expectation. You know, obviously, I know it's a lot, a lot of words, a lot of acronyms and numbers there, but there is a metric out there that says that Mac Jones is the fifth worst quarterback in football. Well, there you go. So there you go. You can um, have, you can put them there if you want. All right. So uh, your Roosevelt is uh, is um, Davis Mills. Mine was uh, Mac. I Which guess. Which one for has my, the longest neck? For my Abraham, <laughs> <laughs> that, that's what I got to know. Which one has the longest? I think neck? Washington, right? He's the one. He's sort of looking off to the side. Like, well, then that might have to be Davis Mills. There you go. Davis Mills, very long. He's neck. basically a prosauropod. <laughs> if anybody knows what what those are, go go look those up. Former dinosaur guy here. Go look up what an Ankysaurus is, like a prosauropod. It's okay. literally Davis Mills. I'm giving Davis Mills a break because that team just sucks so badly that I don't think anything was. He was never expected to put up any good numbers this year. Uh, in Instead, instead of uh, Davis Mills, I'm going to give my Abraham Lincoln spot on Mount Rushmore to Matt Ryan as the fourth worst quarterback in the league right. this year. Uh, benched multiple times, I think. Uh, I know he went down with an injury at one point, too, and his overall numbers aren't the worst I've ever seen. But uh, he was he was really bad. They expected him to come in there and uh, and fix up that offense, and he definitely could not do it. And uh, you know, now you see sort of a, basically the end of his career. So I'd have him fourth, and my runner-up would be Marcus Mariota, another guy who got benched. Not someone who I think had big expectations or whatever, no, but yeah. a third overall pick, whatever he was, like a guy who should be better than he is. Um, I thought he really sucked this year for Atlanta, too. Yep. Nope. He's he's definitely bad. I mean, Des, Desmond Ritter is is one of those guys. I understand that they want to get a look at him, but coming out, I never really cared for Desmond Ritter at all. So to me, if you want to see Desmond Ritter over Marcus Mariota, which is not a surprise to me at all, because I've seen Marcus Mariota play this year and it's not very good. Um, that tells you all you need to know about Marcus Mariota. He was always going to be a placeholder. It's kind of how I feel about Trubisky in Pittsburgh as well. So, I mean, like, Trubisky was always going to cede that job to Kenny Pickett. There was no way he was holding it. <laughs> yeah. Um, Texter says, uh, not only do you guys not know football, but you don't know anything. Mount Rushmore, are you kidding me? It's four guys. <laughs> You're right about that. Yeah, We, I mean, don't, I mean, we don't really know anything. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, sure, sue me. I don't know four old dudes on a mountain. Like, I'm sorry, I learned about that like 20 years ago. I know. It's not really top of mind for me. So Although I, you, did, you did study dinosaurs. Yeah, I did study dinosaurs, and perhaps they would count under that. But uh, they're not my favorite kind, so we're not gonna we're not gonna do that. I actually went and saw Mount Rushmore. Uh, me and some friends because I went to school out in Colorado, so we drove up to South Dakota, wherever it is. Yeah, see, and, I uh, see, I I, I checked I, it out. So I, it is. You went to school next to the state, and you still don't know where it is. I That's still, how uninteresting it is. No, see, idea. I, I've literally never been to Mount Rushmore, so like I said, sue me. Don't care. I knew it was Washington on one end, Lincoln on the other end. Two guys in the middle. Yeah. Mm, Ben Franklin, like if you told me Ben Franklin was on my <laughs> right, I'm like, it. yeah, sure, yeah, of course. Is it as uninteresting as the old man in the mountain in New Hampshire? Hey, 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 Rest hey, in hey. peace, by the way. Bite Rest your tongue, peace. sir. <laughs> the old man in the mountain was uh, was not charted, carved into the mountain. This that was true. au naturel, my friend. That is very, very different. The old man in the mountain was not uh, meant to be one person. It was not, you know, a tribute to some president. That was just a man. That was Holy a man crap, up on I the triggered mountain. Arcane. Yes, you did. I don't like people talking bad about the old man <laughs> okay, in the mountain. Okay, when so the old man in the mountain and fell down. I cried. Wow. I cried. Wow. Wept when I when the old Woo. man crumbled. Woo. I did. Whoa, ho, ho. Wow. Yeah. You really, messed, down now. You really messed up there, buddy. I gotta say Oops. though. Now, now what we gotta do? Oops. Now, yeah, exactly. <laughs> now, now apparently uh, to to you know redeem ourselves, we have to name all the presidents in order or something without looking them up. 